Welcome to the video, my friends. Today, we're going to check out Scorn. I've been waiting for this game for some while. It's been delayed, I think, a couple of times for a long period. And the footage originally really piqued my interest, being a HR Giga type of inspired game. Uh, I don't think it's like a full-on shooter type thing. I think it's just more of a body horror gore fest with uh, some really messed up visuals. So let's jump in. We'll check out the settings here just quickly. Uh, what do we got? Motion blur off brightness uh we've done that just now and that's it no video settings we are on an xbox series x uh so i hope it just looks really nice with no video settings but we'll see i hope nobody's got any phobias this guy looks a little bit gruesome Oh, it's us. It's our player. Who were those bones? Ugh. Okay, this game looks good. Yeah, those fog and mist effects looked pretty sweet. Well, it appears we fell down a hole down from up there. Fog and mist effects looked pretty nice. Okay, the detail is, yeah, very HR Giga. Can we open this door? Okay, we can't open that door yet. I think we need something. Uh, we can go around this way, though, around this hallway. The atmosphere in this is 10 out of 10 already. Still the particles, the mist, the fog. We're going around this room here, big circular room. Let's head down this hallway. I'm hoping it's not a scary game, jump scares. It's going to be gross. I can already tell that. We've got a spire in the middle of the room here. Have to get in there somehow. we got a door there going down. Another door here. Looks like we got another panel we can't actually use. So yeah, this is on Game Pass as well. I downloaded it on the Series X to check out. It's looking and running really well on the uh, console. Now we can actually use this door. Well, I hope we don't need to go back out there. Want to drive this? Just zoom around in this little alien scooter thing. Oh, we got a little thing here. Looks very sexual. Which was a big thing for HR Giga, wasn't it? His artwork was very uh, sexualized. Oh, no. Get off. Oh, an assassin's blade. Nice. What was that other film as well that had the gun that was made of bones and stuff? It was a weird film. We're going to stick our hand in this as well. and Ah, oh, Robocop style. The glove looked like it was made of flesh. Right, what do we do here? Direct and use. Oh, 
There we go. My bad. My bad. Ah, there we go. Let's exit this terminal. <gasps> We've got to be quick. Hope there was nothing else in there. Well, we've made it into that spy room. Okay. I'm loving the style of this. The design, the detail. Anything down there? Nope. Right, let's try and figure out how we get to the center here. We've got another thing we can use. Hmm. It did nothing. Sticking our fingers and hands into a lot of holes, though. Let's go up the little spire here. If we got another little interface somewhere, what's this? Like it's been vandalized. Oh, hello. We can open and close these walkways. So if we close all that up. We might be good that. It looks like something comes in. At one of those exits and we have to send it in somehow. Maybe. Like kind of a tramway or of some kind. Well, there's, like, there's nothing friendly in one of those at one point. We have to use one of them. Well, it's a pile of bodies. There's bodies everywhere. They look very alien. Very alien. Let's see what we've missed. There's some more controls out here, so let's have a look. What we can do. Okay, we got a good chair. And there is nothing we can grab to put in that chair or whatever that is. So hopefully this other control will allow us to put something there. Oh, I see. We've got to move it around. Make room to get a single into that spot. I kind of made a thud sound as well when I put that one in there. There we go. I'm feeling that shouldn't have happened. Okay, I've moved all these over. And this one with the shiny one on the top that looks very similar to that one that I broke. It's got one dangling off the bottom. And I'm hoping this one doesn't break. 
But I think that's the only one that's going to fit. So this, this has got to be it. This has got to be it. But yeah, that, that was a bit long-winded, moving everything to that side to get that to that side. But I hope this is it. Oh, it's looking like we got it. I'll get you out of here, buddy. Don't you worry. Probably. All right. Let's try and meet him. Okay, I've just put him back. Uh, okay, now it's working. Okay. I think I just had to pull down to lower the crane. All right, buddy. I'm just going to push you around quick. Hold on tight. Jesus. Hold it up like a pretzel inside there. Can't be comfortable. Okay, just a small procedure here. Uh, hold on tight. Okay, I'm not sure what I did there. But I don't think he liked it too much. We'll have you out of there, dude. We'll have you out of there and on your way home soon. Don't you worry about it. I hope I didn't wake you up from your slumber up there, by the way. I don't know. I apologize if I did. A ah, funny story. I, I fell down a hole. <laughs> I shouldn't actually be here. Uh, I slipped and, uh, yeah, this is just where I am. Kind of feel sorry for him, though. His big eyes there. And he has no idea what's about to happen. But if it's any comfort to you, neither do I. It's all going to hurt me as much as it does you, my friend. Right. Let's see what this actually does. Gonna crack that egg for you. We'll get you out of that egg soon, mate. Get you sat in this chair. It's these animations as well, these sound effects. So good. Oh, I see. I think I'm just gonna crack the egg open. Yeah. My, my assumption was correct. We are genuinely going to help you out, my friend. Just do not move. Whatever you do. Oh, I... Did I, did I touch you there? A little bit, maybe. Got a bit of bone exposed. I'll just get you out of there. That's got to be better though, right? Come on, tell me. Uh, do you want a hand up? Come on, grab a hand. You'll get it. Come on, you're going to get the hang of it. Oh, look at that. They learn so fast.
You okay? Can we go now? Where, uh... Where, where do we go now? I want to hold your hand and you lead lead the way, or do I have to lead the way? Let me, let me lead the way. You're going to follow me? Am I like your mother now? Oh, I see. He's going to follow me. I am his mother. And uh, we will call him Bob. Probably probably don't do that because you scared the crap out of me a little bit, Bob. No sudden movements, please. Okay, we've had come... Oh, okay. Back down here. I, I walked straight past this thing again. It turns out Bob actually needs it. So, uh... Let me just pick him up here. There we go. Shove his hand in there. No idea what he's complaining for. I just had that procedure done and it was fine. Come on. Oh, got to pick him up again and latch him onto that one, I guess. There we go. Right, hold on there. Let me just flick this switch. We got it. Well done. Can I take you with me? Oh, I guess this is where we part ways. Well, you were a good help, my friend. If I can come back for you, I will. I have no idea what I just did there. Not sure what this place is, but it's gross. But for now, I'll leave it there for scorn. Let me know your thoughts. My first impressions, very well built game. I'm glad we waited this long for it and they delayed it as it's pretty solid and very impressive looking atmospheric. And the audio is pretty much top tier. And it's on Game Pass, so if you're a Game Pass member, you get to play this for technically free on PC and Xbox consoles. As always, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel to continue to see the videos that I create. Most of all, thank you for watching. This place is gross. And I'll see you peeps next time.